Hi everybody, this is Tracy from Northeast Tarot and welcome to your monthly tarot love forecast. Um, before I get started with the reading, I just want to take a second and thank all of my subscribers. Thank you so much. Thank you for your shares. Thank you for your likes. Thank you for your lovely comments. Um, if you are interested in receiving a daily oracle guidance message, I do actually draw and upload daily to my Instagram page. I draw a daily oracle guidance card and upload it every single day. Um, if you are interested in a private reading, I do actually have my website linked below in the description bar. Now, for these for these general love forecasts, um, if, if for some reason you cannot resonate with them in regards to a romantic relationship, they can be applied to business relationships, um, relationships with family members or friends. So it doesn't necessarily just have to be in regards to a romantic relationship. This can, can be applied to any relationship within your life. Um, please do watch not only your sun sign, but also your moon sign and, and rising sign as well. Just to get the most insight. So I hope you all have a great month and enjoy the reading. Hi Leo, this is Tracy from Northeast Tarot and welcome to your February monthly tarot love forecast. This is something new that I am trying and if all goes well then I will try to incorporate um, you know more love forecast into the into my channel so please let me know if you do find this love forecast helpful okay so this is for leo sun leo moon and leo rising signs all right leo so as you can see i've um, laid out the cards already I, i've done four tarot cards an overall energy card and then an additional guidance card i've done this i i've laid everything out just to save on some time so let's get started the first card that i have pulled for you leo is the empress And the Empress really represents fertility, creativity, birth, new beginnings, birthing new creative ideas or hobbies. Just, you know, she represents being extremely creative. I feel like, Leo, you're working very hard towards um, either like a maybe being more creative with it within your partnership or within a relationship um and 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 yes um you know this is focusing on love relationships but also um any relationships this can be you know friendships this can be relationships with family members or even sometimes you know you might be able to resonate um with this reading in regards to like a business relationship or business partnership but I feel like you're coming through as as very creative um, and you might even be, you know, very fertile at this time in February as well. So do keep that in mind, not just fertile with, you know, creative ideas, um, but, you know, fertile as as in physically fertile. So if you don't want to get pregnant, please take proper precautions. Um, but I feel like you're working very hard, maybe in regards to um, a new beginning. Um, now, if you are a Leo who maybe just recently got into a partnership, this could be you working very hard, being very creative and nurturing um, in regards to this partnership. If you have maybe recently met someone, this can be you just simply being creative. And she does represent the mother, the motherly type figure. So you can just be extremely creative, but also loving, caring, compassionate, um, very nurturing in February. Now, if you already are a mother, of course, you can, um, you know, be even more nurturing than you normally are. But I feel like you're working, to, you know, on the relationship. You're working, you know, especially if you just met the person, this could be you working on that new beginning. You're working on that partnership. And if you're, if you've already been in like an established partnership, this could be you working um, with your partner. On, on making your dreams come true no matter you know you know that could relate to in so many different ways no matter if that's like moving in together no matter if that's starting a family or or, or getting married I feel like you you're working very hard
I feel like there's definitely something that you're very passionate about because I also have um, the Page of Wands here. In this deck, it's the Princess of Wands, but it is the Page of Wands. So this is definitely you... For some Leos, this can be you waiting on news in regards to maybe something you're working very hard towards. Um, but, you know, this can be that, that new beginning. You know, something you're very passionate about. Um, I am seeing a lot of passion here. And a ton of creativity. Um, you know, if you're in a, an established partnership, I, I feel like you're you're going to be very creative in regards to your your partnership, your your romantic partnership. Um, maybe especially around like Valentine's Day. I also have the magician here, so you feel empowered. This is you having all of the tools, the resources to be able to just make your your dreams. Uh, manifest. So, you know, if you are in a partnership, if you do want to take things to the next level, if you do want to start a family, this is you being empowered. This is you being able to do that. I feel like, you know, if you are maybe um, communicating with your partner that this is something you want to do, if you do want to start a family, I feel like he's going to absolutely just, um, he or she, I should say, they're going to be very happy with that. Um, they're going to, they're going to agree with you. They're, I feel like they all feel the same. The overall energy for the entire month, I have dreams dreams coming true this is the card that i pulled for you leo and this is just like the nine of cups in the traditional tarot so this is your dreams coming true so no matter if you're partnered or single um you're very empowered if you're single this is you um having all of the resources that you need all you have to do is, is put yourself out there, be social, get out of the house, um, you know, spend time with friends or family and just get out and about and mingle because um, everything is in place. And honestly, the additional guidance card that I pulled for you, Leos, was attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. This was the additional guidance card that I pulled for you. So this is saying that, you know, when you focus on yourself and do the things that you love and you live in the here and now, in the present moment, people are attracted to your energy that you put out. Because when you're happy and you're living in the, in the here and now and you're just enjoying yourself, people are attracted to your energy that you put out, that your happiness and just, yeah, that energy, it's very attractive so if you are single, you very much can attract romantic love just by enjoying yourself, by enjoying the present moment. So I feel like if you are single, February, honestly, is, is a great month to meet someone. Just do the things that you love. Focus on yourself. Get out and mingle. Don't stay home and th just think that love is going to show up on your doorstep. No, no, no. You have to get out and just, just, yeah, enjoy yourself. People will be very attracted to you this month, Leo. No matter if you're already partnered, no matter if you've been married for 10 or 20 years, or, you know, if you're single, I feel like your partner or the person that you're going to meet for those singles, you know, they're going to be very attracted to you. Your dreams are coming true. So if you are a Leo that, you know, you do want to take your relationship to the next level, um, I feel like that's happening as well. Whatever you want this month, Leo, I feel like it's your month. This is absolutely your month. You're empowered. You're beautiful. You're just extremely creative. You hold all the tools to make things manifest. You 
Yeah. Yeah. You're just, you know, you have the Empress here. This is just you being just beautiful. And people are very much attracted to you. So Leo, um, I do hope that you've enjoyed this reading. Um, please let me know what you think. I just hope you guys have a wonderful February. Take care.